Song of Myself, Section 13, by Walt Whitman, read by Alan Davis Drake. The Negro holds firmly the reins of his four horses. The block swags underneath on its tide over chain. The Negro that drives the long dray of the stone yard, steady and tall, he stands poised on one leg on the string piece. His blue shirt exposes his ample neck and breast and loosens over his hip band. His glance is calm and commanding. He tosses the slouch of his hat away from his forehead. The sun falls on his crispy hair and mustache, falls on the black of his polished and perfect limbs. I behold the picturesque giant and love him. I do not stop there. I go with the team also. In me the caresser of life wherever moving, backward as well as forward slewing, to niches aside and junior bending not a person or object missing, absorbing all to myself and for this song. Oxen that rattle the yoke and chain or halt in the leafy shade, what is that you express in your eyes? It seems to me more than all the print I have read in my life. My tread scares the wood drake and wood duck on my distant and day-long ramble. They rise together, they slowly circle around. I believe in those winged purposes, and acknowledge red, yellow, white, playing within me, and consider green and violet, and the tufted crown intentional, and do not call the tortoise unworthy because she is not something else. And the jay in the woods never studied the gamut, and the look of the bay mare shames silliness out of me. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.